this is another step in the process, another direction. We want, we've always wanted to take women's bobsleigh. We've always wanted to have our own four women event, um, you know, and, and hopefully in doing this for this whole next second half, you know, the world will see, the other girls will see, the FIBT and, and Bobsleigh Canada will see that, you know, we can, we can do this. But it's nice to have this option. It's nice to be able to, to challenge myself, to push the other girls to really step up, be better, and we'll see what happens. You just want to push, 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 come up. Here. We're going from second day ever pushing in the ice house as a four-man team to next week we're competing at a World Cup level with the men. So it's the most massive learning curve you could ever possibly imagine. Um, but we're up for the challenge and I think it's going to be a great experience. Um, historically in bobsled, women um, from Canada have always been kind of a leading factor in terms of getting two men going when women started competing in the two-man event. And now again with the four-man, getting that going um, gives us athletes all practice this and because it is a whole different ball game um, practice essentially practicing a new sport is necessary to be able to excel at it and getting this jump on the world even going into the test event at world championships this year is going to be huge for us I don't want to do this just for funsies because it's a cool opportunity. I want to do this. I want to do this right. I want to win. And right now we're the only women's crew doing it, but we're going to use, you know, the lower ranked men's team as somebody to gun for. Um, it's not about men versus women. It's, it's literally about us being the very best right now that we can individually. Let's go!